What are these? Grey Warden documents. What? Who goes there? What's that all about? I thank you for creating such distraction, stranger. I have been waiting days for the opportunity. Do you think you could... Alistair? Is that you? Who... Wait. I do know you. You were at my joining. He's one of us. A warden from Orlais. Oh. Jada, I think. Or was it Monsumar? I'm afraid I don't remember your name. Amri Orden, senior warden of Jada, but born and bred in Hyever, and glad to be home. Huh. A Grey Warden! Oh my god. Are these your papers? I found them upstairs. Yes. These are my records. The names of the dead I could recognize at Astagar. What I could find of Duncan's own recruitment records. Copies of the joining ritual I rescued from our Denerim vault. Those should never be seen by any outside eyes. But I trust in their encryption. Hmm. So, where's how? I saw him going to the dungeons. He may still be there. Right. And what are you doing here, exactly? For the most part, attempting to hold my tongue. I was sent when we received no word from King Kaelin as to the outcome at Ostagar. The King had invited all the Wardens of Orlais and their support troops to join him. Then nothing. Hmm. So how large a force did you bring with you? We had 200 Wardens and two dozen divisions of cavalry. The first we heard of Logain's edict was when everyone was turned back at the border. That was when the rumor reached us that wardens were being blamed for the massacre. We finally decided it was safest to send someone alone to learn how best to fight the Blight and this regime simultaneously. As a native Ferelden, I volunteered to make the crossing. Alone? But the Archdemon's nearly here! Will we have no help? The other wardens won't risk their strength fighting Ferelden's civil war. If they spend themselves against Loghain, there is truly no hope. They recall accounts of the first blight, how many cities fell. If Ferelden is too foolish to save itself, at least, we'll be ready when the Archdemon leads its forces further. Besides, I hear you haven't been doing badly at raising an army yourself. But perhaps if the Edict can be lifted, I will send a message as soon as we are gone from this place. Right, okay, fine, fine. So... How did our even capture you? With an offer of hospitality and a poison chalice. I was fool enough to think Loghain didn't yet know who I was. Okay. Well, why don't you come with me? I wouldn't be much use to you in my current condition. And if you'll pardon me, I have a sudden desire to breathe some free air. I will seek you out later. After I find a good physician. And good luck, brother. The Great Warden. Didn't think I'd see one, to be perfectly frank with you. Now we're going down to the dungeon then. Right, so we're looking for Al Howe and his mage friend, are we? Right, kid, okay. So open sesame. Who goes? Uh. Horston. Anybody tries to come in here without Howe's say so, we get to do what we like with them. I think we finally got a bit of entertainment here, lad. Just try it, sweet cheeks. Oh. Son of a gun! Oh my god, what the hell just happened there? Oh, 
must have kicked him down there, big time. <laughs> Get to rise up. Tell me, where to now? Up, oh, more of them. Bloody whining, Alistair. No! Oh, torture, is it? Oh my god, the bloody guns all over this place! God, is he, al order. is he alive? Oh, you look like you're in a bit of a pickle there, man. Was this supposed to be a lesson? Did my father think it funny to leave me for so long before sending you? Uh, and who are you exactly? Then my, my father didn't send you? I am Oswin, son of Ban Sigurd, of the Dragon's Peak Banon. If you aren't one of our soldiers, pray tell me, who should I be thanking for my rescue? Uh, you should be thanking me, Horston of the Grey Wardens. Then I have no question about why you would come, Warden. For it is your men who have suffered the most here. You have my heartfelt gratitude. And, I assume, the gratitude of the entire Dragon's Peak Banon. If my father sent no one after me, I can only assume that he does not yet know the true colors of the snakes he is allied with. But if you talk to him, I'm certain he would offer you any reward you might ask. Hmm. Why was Al how torturing you? One soldier returning from Ostagar was my wet nurse's son. We have been friends since birth. He told me his unit was ordered to turn their backs on Kalen at Ostagar before the Darkspawn overwhelmed him. The next day he disappeared. When I went to search for him, I accepted a drink from a stranger and ended up here. Will your father side against Logan at the Landsmeet? Then there is a Landsmeet after all. How said the Earl of Rickcliffe was dead and the Landsmeet called off? I swear if there be any forum to speak out against Logan, my father will be there. Now please, I must try to get to him. I cannot see the last of this place too soon. New quest, tortured noble. Sicard might appreciate being told about this. Yes, that will also assist us in turning people against Logan. Logan. Oh god, look, people being hung. Wall of spikes. Oh god. Bloody 
It's sickening. Is that people's heads on there as well? Heads on spikes. Whoops a daisy. I'll get Oh! Do you hear it? Do we? Sounding the horns for retreat. Do you hear it? Can we not get him out? Ah. Key to lower prison. Sounding the horns. Sounding the horns for retreat. Do you hear it? Do you hear the dogs howling? I'm trying to open your door, man. They said to retreat. The horn sounded and we turned and then the screams. We rode and they screamed and screamed and... What? <sighs> okay. It's all right. Mother, can you smell the blood? They said it was only dogs born. But we hate them too. They died. And we left them in the swamp. The witch. The witch. He's obviously mad. I don't think you'll get anything more out of him. Hmm. Right, you're free. Go somewhere safe. Safe? Is there a safe? Perhaps next door. Must updated. You found Rexel. Report back to the chanter. I can let you out as well. What month is it? Are you some enemy of our Urians? Please, I feel like I've spent half my life down here. Al Urian? I don't even know who he is. You're free. Don't waste my time. <laughs> no, that's a bit rude. Why were you imprisoned here? The Arl's son. He abducted my bride on our wedding day. When I tried to rescue her, I don't remember. She was screaming and he was laughing and I charged at him. And woke up here. I don't know if she's even still alive. Hmm. Right, well, enough chit-chat. Get out of here. I've no time to waste. Uh, of course not, sir. Uh, will, will I have to flee the city now? The Jarl won't like it if I escape, but never mind. Uh, I'll leave you to your uh, business. Yes, yes. Off we go, please. <sighs> right. Come on! <laughs>